Welcome back everybody. Now as promised, here I'm going to do another Albert Finney movie, um, which is guaranteed to make y'all smile. Uh, it's a mus It's another musical. It's Annie. Of course, there's uh, Albert Finney now with no hair and young. Uh, this has got Albert Finney, of course, as, you know, Daddy Warbucks, Carol Burnett, Bernadette Peters, Anne Re King, Tim Curry, Jeffrey Holder, Edward Herman, who is, and I, and I keep bringing this movie up, uh, The Lost Boys, uh, he played in that, and uh, Sandy the Dog. Um, oh, and Aileen Quinn. Aileen Quinn played Annie in this movie. Um, which, of course, that's her. She doesn't look like that now, obviously, because this was another one of those 1980 films that was actually, you know, released back in 1981. Um, Bernadette Peters, I haven't seen her in a movie in, like, a while. Um, and Carol Burnett in this movie is just... I like her in it, even though she plays a drunk. She's absolutely hysterical. But Albert Finney in this movie kind of reminds me of my dad, like he does in Big Fish. Um, and that's part of the reason why I wanted to do these two together, because it's just, you know, um, Annie remind well, Albert Finney's character, Daddy Warbucks, kind of reminds me of my dad from when I was a little girl. And then Big Fish is kind of like, you know, teenage, adult, everything. And that's why I wanted to link these two together is because, you know, I always, you know, looked up to my dad and respect him. I still do now. And, but, you know, some of the stories he tells about when I was a kid, you know, I look at him like he's grown a second head and everything. And I'm like thinking, why are you telling people this story? You know, and that's kind of like, you know, Big Fish. Um, but anyway... I do recommend watching this with your kids, especially your younger kids, you know, because it is a PG. Um, this version is, you can tell that it was shot in the 80s just because, or the early 80s, because it, it is a dead giveaway because it's just, you know, like some of the outfits and, you know, the shots and everything are so, so 1980s, like early 80s. That's you know amazing but it is a good movie and i do recommend it you know for families it's family friendly watching okay now hang on and i'm gonna do my uh next movie review which has got nothing to do with family friendly it's just twisted okay hang on 